Hey guys, welcome back! And after leveling Frederick to level 10, we can continue on. Of our journey to see whatever surprise you want us to see at night. Say the la dee da dee dee. Is there anything over here? Some birdies. Let's see. Hey, I've got a peach cookie. Hell yeah. Hello there, bud. Here's an item. If she can open it. Oh, a coffin necklace. I think she can wear that. Let's see. Yep, she can. Defense went up. Let's go to the magical, magical whatever it is at night. Dead in. If I like, save. And that nigga, he's about to go to level, uh, level 11. This keeps up. Well, it's not the, it's not a bad thing. Well, it's big open space. Why? What the hell is that? I was wondering these types of games. It's always a pig. Sorry, but I'm in a hurry. Yeah, we're in a hurry. You gotta see someone that comes at night, douchebag. Douchebag <laughs> coming! I'm sorry. Got on the butt. Yo, take, take off! Now you will rest. Dang it, I did it too fast. Orange glow. There you go, Frederick. Perfect. Don't echo high. Right. Now you will sleep. Now you will sleep. Damn it, damn it. Dare attack me, demon. I'm sorry. Oh, we have you. There is no way for you to stop. I oh, look, he's well up. Much better. Yeah, much better, dude. Good job. Whoa, I usually get that when I'm with the kids. Moon is now counted in real time. The extra will start decreasing after your first step and will continue to do so even when standing still. That's scary. Okay. It was better when you can stop and think. But I think it makes it harder, so I think that's alright anyway. I guess it's kind of dangerous out here when it's late at night. The animals in the forest never used to be this aggressive before. By the way, the question you asked me earlier, you never told me if I answered it correctly. Hmm? Of course, this is all a story I've created in my head. So, there's no way I could possibly be wrong. You're wrong. <laughs> come on, come on, it's almost time. Hurry, Frederick. Wait. These flowers are what I wanted to show you. Oh, flowers? Flowers? L 
Look at them. They're blossoming. Who lilies? Oh, they're not lilies, but you know. Oh, I'm sorry, I kind of like the song. That's why I was like, oh god, I gotta shut up. Like a reflection of the starry sky on the meadows. Huh. This is the only place they bloom in the forest. These flowers never bloom during the day, only at night. What when the sun is up, they stay in their buds, but they're able to absorb sunlight with their leaves. And after night falls, they let out all the light they've stored when they blossom. It always happens at exactly two o'clock in the morning. I don't know who to vote for here, skater or the They're beautiful. Absolutely stunning. It truly is a wondrous sight. But they're also called death lights. Death lights? The sun brings life, but the dark brings death. And these flowers bloom in darkness. So, darkness is evil, light is good. Whether you want to call them Heaven's Mirror or Death Lights, that's up to you, Frederick. But I guess, these days, pretty much everyone has taken to calling them Death Lights. Because they're douchebags. Long ago, it was thought they looked like the light that guided people to death, since they blossom the opposite of regular flowers. Even now, a lot of people don't like these flowers. To many, they're still considered a bad omen. Aww. That's also how they think of me. <sighs> Not the kids, though. Frederick, you said before that this whole world is all just a dream you're having. Right? But, if this is your dream, and you can be so positive that what's happening is just a dream, how can you tell which is the real world, if what you're experiencing in the dream is that realistic to you? And to prove my point, you didn't read my mind earlier. You were wrong. I was thinking about leaving Tenuto. I want to go out into the world and live my own life. Even if that life only exists inside your dream. Let's see. I don't know how much time I have left to live. But I want to live what's left of my life in a positive way. Bringing happiness to others. I just want to help people somehow. You will, girl. Like these flowers, even though people call them death lights, they still blossom and struggle to live on. You're going to leave the village? But where do you intend to go after you leave Tenuto? I'll go to Forte Castle, and then I'm going to meet with the Count to ask about the taxes on floral powder. Because right now, they're hurting everyone in the village. Wow, really? You know, you should be happy you couldn't read my mind. Since you can't use magic, it means you don't have an incurable illness. <sighs> Please, stay at my house tonight. I'll tell my mom you're coming. You're a guest in our dream world, after all. 
That's not something that happens every day. <laughs> You just got told, dude. A flower that resembles you. A bad omen. Death lights. Hmm. Friday pig was protecting it. Now we're back to the boys. Look, it's a lizard. Well, Riddle, this is the first time I'm going outside Red Ardondo. It's not like we're going on a picnic, Beat. Don't get so excited. Yeah, I know that, Riddle. No need to be a we're dick. We're going to help Red Ardondo's poor by getting the leaders to lower taxes on stuff besides the mineral powder, right? That way, everyone can afford blankets and cheese and all the honey-covered bread they could ever possibly want. Then everyone can finally be happy. Right, Reddo? That's exactly right. Hey, I'm proud of you, Beat. We can't solve things by just stealing bread. We have to uncover the real root of the problem. Yeah, the you taxes. said it. <laughs> so, uh, where are we going anyway? <sighs> you mean you don't know? Jeez, I take back what I just said. We're heading to Forte Castle to talk to the guys in charge. Come on, let's go. Hey, Riddle, wait up! Man's be tired. I do that every day. Let's see it again. Before we leave, we should probably see how the kids in the sewer are doing. Okay. Well, first, let's also see if there's any new weapons in the store. Oh, and I also sell the photos I pictured. Look, rank B. Kinda sucks. Hey, I got a Ruto in there. You can get mine if you want to. See, hunting knife. Nope, same stuff. Kind of sucks. Let's talk to see if this bitch is gonna say something new today. Come on, I'm fresh uh, direct from Tantro. Hey! Where's that girl at? I mean, I wanna go on a date with her and stuff, you know? It's like, Beavis and Butthead wants to go on a date with girls. Our boat got smashed in the last storm. We were planning on doing some fishing tomorrow. Not even exercise seems to dry my tears. Oh, that's what you guys were doing yesterday. With Tintoro. Tintoro, I like Tintoro. Probably healed up, just skipped through all the freaking rats. Well, try to. <laughs> 